how is it going everybody mr android here i know it's been a while but finally we are back with a brand new episode of best home screen setups in today's video we will be taking a look at this beautiful minimal home screen setup that i have created using the niagara launcher Guys, I recently shifted to this launcher and if you are a person who really want to have a simple and a clean home screen, then you should definitely install Niagara Launcher. I think it's one of the best minimalistic launcher that you can get from the Play Store. So with that said, if you really want to replicate this exact look using Niagara Launcher, then make sure to watch this video till the very end. Also, let's aim for at least 1000 likes on this one. So drop a like, leave a comment and let's get started. First things first, let's talk about this beautiful wallpaper that I'm currently rocking on my home screen. I got this wallpaper from an app called Wardrobe, which is a free application where you can find some great collection of wallpapers. Now in case if you're not interested downloading a separate application just to get this wallpaper, then I'll make sure to drop a direct link to this wallpaper in the description below so you can go ahead and download it. Now once you are done setting up the wallpaper, next what you have to do is head over to the play store and download niagara launcher you will have a simple looking home screen and it's not gonna look exactly like this there are a couple of changes that i have done in order to get this beautiful look on my phone and i'm gonna show you how you can do that the first thing we will talk about is the icons the icon pack that i'm using on this setup is called niagara dots and the best part is you don't have to separately download this icon pack it comes with the launcher itself and if you want to apply this icon pack Go to the launcher settings, select features, then go to look and make sure you select the icon pack as Niagara dots. I really like these icons. It gives you a minimal vibe and I think it matches perfectly with the entire setup. Moving on, let's talk about the widget. What I have done is I have removed all the stock widgets and then I have applied this beautiful KWGT widget, which I think looks really, really nice. Now to do that, again, go to the launcher settings, select features. And here you need to select this option that says Niagara widget. You can go ahead and disable all the basic widgets that comes inside this launcher. I wanted to see my battery percentage so I have just enabled the last widget. Now in order to set a brand new widget on your home screen, tap and hold on any widget and select this option called add custom widget. Here you get a list of all the widgets. From here all you have to do is select KWGT and then select the widget pack. Now the pack that I'm currently using for this setup is called Blended KWGT which offers some amazing collection of widgets and trust me, they all look beautiful on your home screen. As you can see, this is the widget that I'm using on my setup. So just go ahead and set it on your home screen. Apart from setting up the widgets and the icon pack, I have made some more changes. When I go to the launcher settings, you can see I have hide the status bar and alphabets that appears next to the applications. Well, I know a lot of you still prefer Noah Launcher, but I will highly recommend you to give this one a try. It has a bunch of useful features with some beautiful animations. Guys, if you really want to keep your home screen neat and clean, then you can definitely install Niagara Launcher. Links to all the applications will be listed down in the description below. If you still face any issue or if you are unable to replicate this exact setup, then let me know in the comment section. I will definitely help you out. So that's it for this video. If you guys like this video, then be sure to hit that like button. Subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. I'm Mr. Android and I will see you guys in the next one.